Hey everyone, Joey here, and I got to check out a hands-off preview of Cuphead's DLC titled The Delicious Last Course. Get it? Because... DLC. Okay. In this preview, I took a look at the new setting of the DLC, that being Inkwell Isle, as well as some new weapons, charms, one of the new bosses, and a new character named Miss Chalice. If anything, she seems to be the highlight of the delicious last course, as when you unlock her, you can play the entire game as her. She's not just limited to the DLC. That means you can revisit old bosses and take them on with her new abilities. She can double jump and dodge roll, the latter of which lets her parry automatically. No doubt she'll be a handy character to play as, especially on Inkwell Isle, which is home to a new set of menacing bosses. I heard one of the developers mention that each boss in the Delicious Last Course will be just as difficult as a final boss. I'm shaking in my boots just thinking about that. The boss we got to see in action was Mortimer Freeze, an icy wizard who turns into an evil snowman, then a fridge, and then a giant snowflake. It had all the makings of a challenging Cuphead boss battle. But why are Cuphead, Mugman, and Miss Chalice fighting these new bosses on Inkwell Isle? Well, these bosses hold the ingredients to a wonder tart that can make Miss Chalice whole again, as she occasionally turns into a ghost because she has no control of the astral plane. Very interesting story there, and it's not very convenient for her if you ask me. Miss Chalice is able to take over the bodies of Cuphead or Mugman through an astral cookie so they can take advantage of her unique abilities. Part of the reason why the DLC took so long to finish was because the developers at Studio MDHR used the same hand-drawn animation to continue making the game look great. And that's a lengthy task in and of itself. One that seems to be paying off in spades. So while I didn't get a chance to go hands-on with Cuphead's delicious last course, I still got an idea of how wild and challenging of an experience it will be. If the rest of the bosses are as visually striking and challenging as Mortimer Freeze, then this DLC will have been worth the wait. It'll be releasing on June 30th for $7.99 US dollars on Nintendo Switch, Xbox One, PS4, and PC. Let us know what you think of the delicious last course in the comments section below, and be sure to check out the videos on the right for more topics you might be interested in. Until next time everyone, bye.